Top story, mural downtown Lufkin, a lot of attention right now after large pieces went missing or were covered up. Now, some people have a lot of questions about a construction project changing this staple. KTK's Madison Herbert right now joining me live and tells us why the city was so-called blindsided by this change. Madison. That's right, Neil. When the city sold the building back in March of 2020, they were completely unaware of the new owner's plans to remodel the exterior appearance. The painting was done back in 1998 by an artist named Lance Hunter, and it depicts real residents of Lufkin that actually contributed to the history of this town. The building used to be home to the Lufkin Parks and Recreation Center, but after being sold to the new owners, they began to alter the mural. The city says that this was not their intentions as they know how important this art is to the residents. The people portrayed in the mural are real people and so to some just a, a painting on a wall because that's their great grandfather or great grandmother and so to see it defaced that way it, it's heartbreaking to some people. The company that now owns the building released the following statement, and it says, We at Lee Trans Service are proud of our city's history. We are appreciative of those who have paved the way for us and have great respect for their hard work and commitment. It goes on to say, Renovation revealed that windows had been bricked over. It is important for the well-being of our employees to have as much natural light as possible. So the decision was made to reopen some of the existing windows and add new ones. Unfortunately, this is resulting in a removal of the mural. And tonight at 10, I will introduce you to a long-term resident of Lufkin whose family members were actually depicted in this painting right behind me. I'm reporting live in Lufkin, Madison Herber, KETK News.